Hey guys, how are we doing? As you saw from the previous video, me and my family are currently in the Lake District and I thought this would be the perfect time for me to test the new, more expensive patch antenna to see how far I could get on the range. As you can see in front of me, I'm actually in a massive, massive lake. This is actually Windermere Lake in the Lake District, where we currently are. And I thought I've got plenty of room outside in front of me or the side to test this range and see how far it goes. If I'm honest, I'm a bit frightened because I haven't really flown over water before. Not like this anyway, a little pond near my house, but not over a massive lake like this. So if I lose the drone, I lose the drone, but I'm going to do this test anyway, guys. So I'm not sure if you can see it. I've got 12 on the 12 satellites on the actual quad and nine on the um, transmitter. So what we'll do is we're going to get it up and we'll take it. What we'll do is we'll take it up about 60 meters and then we'll go straight out and see how far we get on this. So I'm just going to arm the motors. There she is. Make sure she's in, well, she's in altitude hold, put her in GPS hold. And let's launch it. Here she goes. I'm not sure if you can see that there, guys. Let's take it out a little bit. And now I'm just going to raise it up to about 60 meters, or maybe even 50 will do. There we go. We're at we're at 56, 57 meters. We'll leave it about there. Straight ahead of me there, up above me, I'm not sure if you can see it. So what we'll do, we'll put full throttle ahead and let's see how far we can get this out. So I am now full throttle ahead, full FPV, working totally fine at the moment. I'm not sure if you can see that guys. That's 61 meters out. And we're just going to keep going straight. To be honest, if I'm honest, it's flying a lot slower than it normally is. We're only at, uh, maybe we're going against the wind at the moment. Yes, definitely we are going against the wind. I can see it from the water. But we still got FPV. Ooh, I moved the antenna a little bit there and lost a little bit. There we go. We are 180, 190 meters out. Over 200 now. Still at 56 meters in height. I can still see the quad right, right out there. It is flying a lot slower than I normally find it flying. Not sure if it's because I'm in the Lake District or going against the wind. It must be because I'm going against the wind. Got full pitch forward though. We're at 304 meters now. Ooh, getting a bit sketchy on that FPV at 300. Stop that there for a second and maybe antennas. Just my antennas. Right, definitely, there you go, back full clear FPV again, and we're at 326 meters, still 56 meters in height, and let's go full forward again. Still quite clear FPV, very clear. I've got to say, this is a beautiful surroundings, beautiful lake. To be honest, the Lake District in general is one of the most beautiful places I've been to. We're now at 420, 430. I really do hope I get to the thousand meters I wanted to. Uh, we're at 475, 490. Sorry about that, guys. I had to turn my head there. My children on the other side making a bit of noise. I think they were calling me. I'll go back to them in a minute They're with the wife at the moment while I do this range test quickly. We are now at 550, getting a bit fuzzy. But there we go, clear again. Let's face it directly towards it. So this patch antenna, you need to make sure any patch antenna, even the previous one, guys, you need to make sure it's facing directly towards the quad. So if you had any buildings or trees, anything in the way, it probably wouldn't work at all. Well, quite sure it wouldn't. We're still at 56 meters higher and now we're going at 620 if you can see that and carrying on rising getting a bit fuzzy on that fpv 
So I'm going to stop it for a second again, move that antenna, and there you go, I've lost it completely there. So, oh, this. Right, I actually don't think this is going to end up working as good as my previous one. See, no. There we go. It's just about moving that antenna, so quite clear FPV again at 658 meters out, 56 meters high. Go full pitch forward again. So we're at 700 now. And again, we've got fuzzy FPV. I'm not liking it. I'd got, I think I got to quite 900 last time, quite clear, didn't I? It's definitely to do with this antenna, though, where it's positioned. There we go, we've gone a bit clearer again. It's 730. 780. And we're hitting 800 and we've gone fuzzy again, so I'll stop it again. Give it a little adjustment on the antenna. As you can see it's still staying quite fuzzy so I'm very fuzzy at 800 which I'd like to get to a thousand if I can't get to 900 I'm definitely putting on the cheaper antenna which is not what I expected oh one second guys there we go I think maybe my quad is actually facing over there that I'm not realizing nope where's the quad No, that loses it completely. Right, what we're going to do is we're going to keep going while it's full. Oh, there we go, we've got FPV back there. So at the moment, I'm not liking this antenna, guys. Oh, there you go, nice and clear again at 811. Let's go forward so as we're clear. And we'll keep going forward now, guys. Really far on the other side of that lake now, all the way over there. Okay, I'm determined to get this to a thousand with FPV. It's very fuzzy right now. We've just gone over 910 meters out and 56 meters high. So we're about nine and a half, a little bit further. Let's get that out to a thousand. Still got FPV, very fuzzy, but I've got FPV at 7.3 volts in battery, one bar. Went 990, guys. Yes, we've gone over a thousand meters in range. Over a thousand meters in range. 7.3 bars on the battery and 0.4 volts. So 7.3 volts, one bar of battery. We're at 1116 meters out and 56 meters high, guys. And as you can see there, right now, with the quad stable and not moving, the FPV is very, very clear. Very clear, indeed. So, well, it's a bit sketchy with moving the antenna around constantly, but it has got further than the previous antenna by 100 meters. Not sure if I'm going to go any further today. Well, I'm not going to go any further today, because I'm over a lake right now. But what we'll do is we'll do a little yaw around, and then we'll hit the return to home and bring it home. FPV goes as I yaw it around. And we'll wait for FPV to come back. There we go. I'm going to do a little yaw around the other side now. 7.2 volts. Should be enough to get it home. 
And there we go. Now what I'm going to do with that fuzzy FPV guys, once again that's 55 meters in height, 1116 meters out in distance. So it did do what it was supposed to do. Yes it was a bit of work with moving the patch antenna about but it got there. So now let's click the return to home and bring it home. FPV goes off and there it goes it's starting to return home now we're already at 916 we were definitely going against the wind guys because it is flying back a lot quicker than it went out yep 930 we're going down very quickly so I actually think if I was flying the opposite way so if I was on the other side of the lake over there I might have got there a lot quicker and maybe with better FPV signal the quad was fighting a lot against the wind. Well, it's coming back.